Happy Mail Queen. Here we are, 15 days until Halloween. Yay! <laughs> so, um, I have a haul video for you guys, and um, I'm going to go ahead and just jump into it. Um, I did go to Michael's and Hobby Lobby, and this is kind of a late haul. This was last week when they had um, a sale on their Halloween... Um, supplies. Uh, they still have it, um, but the day I went, I want to say there was a 20% coupon um, that's supposed to be on top of the sale items. Um, however, I don't know. My Michaels, when they rung it up, um, it did not take off on the sale items. So, hmm, I don't know. Let me know if you guys are having any problems with that too, because um, yeah, I, I would have thought that it was on top of, you know, the sale, but that's what it says on the coupon. Anyway, anyway, it was still a great deal. So let me start off with Michael's. So uh, I was in search of, let me just move my camera over a little bit. I was in search of this right here <laughs> because it's so cute and I love that you get so many pieces and, um, it's a cute skull to me. Um, and I love that it is wood. I love wood embellishments. So the wooden embellishments came out to $1.19. So that was a bargain because usually they're about three bucks. So I got the skull. I'll show you all the ones that were $1.19. Um, and they're the Creatology. Okay, so it's it's in the section where they have the kids crafty stuff. Um, this one is the spiders and they're 18 pieces again and it was a dollar 19. Can you guys see the spider? Erica did a haul on this video too so if mine is not coming out clear you can definitely check out Scrap Diva 29. Um, so yeah these were such a bargain I couldn't pass them up. <clears throat> I did also pick up the Halloween witch hat. Super cute. I just wish the um, the orange glitter was a little bit brighter. It's coming out brighter here on the video, but it's really not as bright as I would like it to be. But anyway, I still, you know, you could always, I don't know, paint over it or put a, a bow. So not a big deal. Um, I also picked this up. Wait, was this from there or Hobby Lobby? I think it was from Michael's. These wooden pumpkin. Um, I hope this was from, from Michael's. I can't even remember, but the packaging looks different because it's um, a different brand, I guess. Or it's still Creatology. Um, you know, this might have been from Hobby Lobby. Now I can't remember. But these are cute. Um... This one for sure was from Michael's. So again, I really wish these were brighter, but it's still cute and I do love the size. And I like the jack-o'-lantern face on this one. And 18 pieces. Um, these came out to the same price. It says Bone Voyage. And it's a little tombstone, super cute. And there's 24 pieces. These are smaller pieces. Um, and then the bats. So I had to pick these up too because you get 20 pieces. They're so cute and they're all wood. So for $1.19, hey, that is such a bargain. Um, so I went there also to get some clothes pins because I want to make some, you know, for like my toppers, to put them behind my toppers. And um, I found the black ones. They had two packages that I was thinking of getting. There was one that had uh, black and a different color, and I can't remember. But I just when I found this one, I decided to get this one because I really wanted just all black. It's just easier to match. Um, so you get 30 pieces, and I've already used some up, so it doesn't look like 30 pieces in there. But um, you do get 30 pieces. So this one, though, was not on sale. It was in that section where they have, like, 
you know, they have their embellishments kind of separate um, by color and it has washi tape and you guys know what I'm talking about. Um, so anyway, um, these, I used a coupon, I think four, because I think these were three dollars. Um, but before I found those clothespin, I found these and um, these, I want to say were 50% off. So I did grab these because I love the words on there. So cute. So that one's really easy. So you don't even really have to decorate it. Um, so I did pick up another treat bag because last time I only, you know, I showed restraint. I only picked up one of these since they were on sale. Um, I decided to grab the kitty one because the one I got, I think, was the striped one last time. And they only had this one left, and it was, there was one other one, so I just decided to get this one. So that was, I think, only about a dollar. Um, was it a dollar or a dollar nineteen? I think they were a dollar nineteen. No, they were a dollar. Yep, ninety-five cents. Um. I picked this one up. They were five dollars. I actually, if you buy two, okay, so you buy one regular price and the second one was half off. But I decided to just get one. I don't know. Maybe I should have gotten the other one. But um, it it comes with the like the glow in the dark. I haven't even opened it yet. So, um, but I like it for the container. <laughs> and my daughter can use like the bracelets too so really cute and I just think it's roomy and I can put embellishments in there um, I picked up one sticker from you know the recollections Halloween section um, just because it's so cute the spooky tree I had bought a spooky tree die that didn't come from AliExpress so when I saw this I said oh you know I think I'm gonna pick these up and they're with the googly eyes so it's so cute and you know it was on sale again I think I can't remember if it was, was 50 or 60 percent off um, since the Tim Holtz Halloween stuff was on sale I really like these cameos I just love the vintage feel to it and even though I do have some cameos from the Dollar Tree um, these just I don't know they they just look like a better quality and um, and I like that guy with the top hat too. So I really liked it. So I did get that. And I think this was a little more pricey. I think it was like $3.59. And then the word bands were $2.39 right here. So these are really cute. And, and then I went there for glitter paper as well but I didn't find the glitter paper that I needed so um I went to Hobby Lobby and I found some stickers now their stuff was only 40% off I think <clears throat> but the Halloween stuff, you know, finally went on sale because the last time I was there, they were not on sale. Only the fall stuff was on sale. So, I got a few things there too. So, first of all, I got some candy because I saw it and I have not seen the lollipops anywhere so um, I don't think I was looking hard enough but um, this is a caramel apple filled and they're Werther's I like Werther's um, I have never tried this before um, but I I usually like you know Werther's candy um, so anyway I thought this would be cute to you know um, put in some treat boxes for my friends so I did get that one and <clears throat> the rest are stickers and crafty things. Um, the stickers were on sale, so I had to grab some. And these were, you know, $1.99, and they were on sale. So 
I had to pick these up. They're so cute. Look at that. The cutesy skulls with the little stars. So I had to grab those. I decided to grab the bats as well because, I don't know, I love putting bats on my Halloween projects. I do. Um, and spiders. <laughs> That's my main thing. I, I love to use these. Um, you know, especially when they're pretty like this and they're small, you can just about stick anywhere. And I love the colors, so grab that and grab these because you can never have enough of these either. Even though I have the sequins one, which I recently bought, um, these are smaller, so I like that. I like to have a variety. So I got that one. And I, I think I did get this at Hobby Lobby, if I'm not mistaken. So these are really cute. <clears throat> and I was looking for this because I saw this online when I was searching on, on at HobbyLobby.com. And I saw it and I was like, oh, I have to get those. Um, and I found them. They were on sale. 40% um, off. So... They're ghost stickers and they're wood. So I thought, oh great, it'll, it'll go well with all my um, wooden embellishments that I bought from Michaels. And they're, it's a cute ghost too, so you can't not get that. <laughs> um, got this set of stickers and I just love how many you get. You see all those words? And they're nice and sturdy. They're um, puffy stickers. So I do like that they're dimensional. Um, so $2 for this one. Um, I found some candy corn um, embellishment. And you get 12 pieces. And I was thinking of um, making them charms. I don't know. I am thinking maybe I can glue a, a bale on the back. Or I don't know if I can put a screw on the end, but I'll try to find a way. Um, <clears throat> we'll see. But they're still cute anyway to add to your projects. <clears throat> um, I did get some more baking cups just because they were on sale. You know, it was a dollar, so a little over a dollar, I think. <clears throat> And I really love the stripes, and I almost didn't get it because I was thinking, I think I have some, and I'm glad I did get it because uh, I don't. I have several Halloween ones, um, but not like this. So I got that. Um, oh, here's the sequence that I was talking about. So this is the first one I saw, um, and they're actually pumpkin bling, so you're supposed to put them on the pumpkin, but I love that... I love the colors, first of all, and the different sizes, because I'm really loving using sequins now. Um, I mean, look how big these other ones are. And you get so many, so I think it's so worth it. So I, I picked that up. Um, I love these flowers. These are probably my favorite fall flowers from Prima. I've used them before on a project uh, a couple of years ago, and I've been meaning to pick up another one so these were on sale um i can't remember i think i used a coupon maybe uh yeah i'm pretty sure they weren't on sale but i absolutely love these colors and i have a project in mind for this one so that's why i picked it up but i love it i think they're so pretty um okay so and then i was in the oh wait first of all along with that cupcake liner I did pick up some lollipop sticks um I don't I didn't find some lollipop sticks that are just this color I thought I picked some up last year or the year before but um I don't know where I placed them and I didn't find it so I just went ahead and picked it up so and I believe that one was on sale as well okay and then I found glitter paper there since I couldn't find it at Michael's, so I did grab some more purple. And this is not exactly the orange that I wanted. I wanted a darker orange, um, but I decided to pick it up because they were on sale. They, these were only a dollar. And, oh, I did pick up the darker orange, but I, I started using it already, so it's somewhere here in my craft room. 
and I have plenty of black so I figured okay I think you know I should be good and um, and then you know they had the paper sale you know their, their kits their pads were 50% off so <clears throat> I got this one right here and what I I've never used chalk paper um, paper before but I thought it was a great idea for those um, embellishments that you want double-sided and you get so many and I love the texture of the back of the chalk it's um, glossy see this is the chalk finish here and this is the glossy so you can use either side and then it's double-sided so I really like that idea um, you know especially when I'm wanting to put a die cut inside it my shaker page I I did do that um, with my one of the skull dies that I got from um, Walmart um, on my October daily I don't know if you guys remember but yeah if it's double-sided then you can stick it with your shaker uh, pocket and then you get both sides of it so um, that's why I, I got this one so I can cut up any shape I want and use it and then I saw this one and this is older um, collection I guess but it was such a good deal you know because everything was you know the paper packs were 50% off and this was only I want to say $8.99 and you know 50% off that and the reason I wanted to get it was because of the papers inside it um, and then you get stickers and die cuts right here so um, here it contains uh, 10 12 by 12 and they are thin papers you guys so you know they're not like but I like the pattern um, what I really like is that plaid right here <laughs> these are the papers you get this one and I really like this one too and that's why I picked it up but I was disappointed because the the color of this is not orange at all it, it looks more like red so um, yeah I was kind of disappointed but I do like the other patterns especially this one right here oh my gosh it's so pretty you do have to back it up on something because um, like I said they are thin so here's a project that they used <clears throat> and then it comes with the border stickers and the clear stickers and I like that it's clear and I love the candy in that one sorry my frame here and then it comes with um, these die cut shapes and frames so there are the shapes look at all the die cuts you get isn't that cool and it, it comes in you know I love that they're doing this now that in their packs they not only have stickers but they have die cuts so that was a clever idea thank you very much Hobby Lobby so yeah I couldn't resist it it's there's 32 pieces in here for like four four dollars for something less than five dollars so I had to grab it um, even though I have like too many papers already but you know sometimes you, you run out of um, Halloween papers after sometimes you get sick of the one you're using because it's like all the same colors pretty much so I love that that one has a variety of colors and it's just more fun to use sometimes so um, I picked that one up oh and I did go to Target so I'll just share with you a couple of things that I picked up but I was trying to be good I picked up the cat ball pins um, I thought they were really cute for a dollar and then the felt stickers I just couldn't help with that face is just so cute so um, for 15 count a dollar you can't beat that they're felt so um, wanted to pick those up too so and I do have a project in mind for that so I think that is it with my haul um, thanks for watching guys and stay tuned for um, some more Halloween projects um, I'm trying to put together so I'll talk to you guys later thanks for watching have a good day bye